What's going on, YouTube? So, uh, I'm making this video because I, I see a lot of strife and I see a lot of drama on YouTube amongst different communities on YouTube. You know, especially in the Christian community, you know, um, I see a lot of backstabbing going on. I see a lot of backbiters. I see a lot of people who are, you know, basically calling themselves defending God by bashing others with an onslaught of of I mean just different stuff you know like you got these date set setters out here which I mean you know I think it's so messed up how these people are on here using God's name not only to profit but to lead, you know, the the body of Christ astray, you know, it's, it's, it is ridiculous, you know what I'm saying, like, all those people that are being false prophets and setting dates, the blood will be on your hands, when you sit, or when you stand in front of God, and have to give an account of everything that you did in your life. What, what are you going to say? What can you say? Nothing. You can't say nothing. You cannot say anything at all. You know? You say that you're hearing from the spirit of God, but you must be hearing from the different spirit, from a different spirit and the God of this world, because everything that you are saying, just because you, you twist it up and make it make sense to align with the word of God. You know, it doesn't, it doesn't make it a sound doctrine, you know, and God is going to punish you for that. I beseech all you date setters and all you people that are bashing one another to repent and ask God to forgive you because you are supposed to treat each other with love, gentleness, kindness, and meekness. You are not supposed to bash your brother or your sister in Christ. You're not supposed to do that. You know, you are grieving the Holy Spirit. You are grieving God's heart when you do this. God can defend himself. He is the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. He is omnipotent. He sees everything. So who are you to take matters into your own hands and bash another brother or sister in Christ just because you don't agree with what they are saying? You don't have that right. And if you and if you do feel the need to correct, you're supposed to correct with love and gentleness and kindness. You're not supposed to bash them. People, wake up, man. This world is this world is so corrupt. This world is so evil. I mean, look at everything that is going on in the world today. Everything. People, please wake up. Please wake up. 
seriously, please wake up. Stop stop bashing one another. Love each other. That's what you're supposed to do. You are commanded by Father God to love your neighbor as you would love yourself. Treat your neighbor as you would treat yourself. Please, I beseech you to please wake up and stop all the arguing and the bickering and the backfighting and the response videos and everything. Just stop it. Please stop it. With that being said, I love you as all my brothers and sisters in Christ. God loves you. And I will see y'all on the next one. Wake up, people.